Hey everybody, KP here. We've been at it since 4 a.m. Pouring concrete. This is one parking lot. For a little jogging trail that we got here. It's now it's about 11.40 Central Time. This is just one of three slabs that we poured. This is the biggest one. I think we had seven concrete trucks come in to pour this one. I know the residents will be happy that we're gone. <laughs> they ain't gotta worry about being blocked up with traffic and all. Let's go to the second one. This is our next project right here. Cross the street to the sidewalk over there. We'll start that one tomorrow, get it all cleaned up, leveled out, up to specs. My life at the beach every day. We got a beach umbrella and everything. Just don't have no good margaritas or beer or anything to go with it, unfortunately. But I get paid to be at the beach. This is the smallest one we did today. I think that was like three trucks, two trucks, something like that. All right, let's go to the third one, which is the second longest. It's the third one. I lost count on how many trucks we had. This just here to connect that jogging path all the way over to here and then across the street right there which we're going to do another section over there to attach it to the other part of the jogging path path takes you underneath I-10 in Metairie. You gotta love getting run over and not get hurt when you get run over. <laughs> Finished leveling this one off yesterday. Got all the wire, wire mesh and stuff like that, and set in the concrete, and we poured everything today. Figured we get an early start on it. That way, it won't be so hot. Today's a little hotter than it was yesterday, but we beat the heat. And if you notice some of the white spots on this concrete. It's a hardener to help drive the concrete faster. Went through four five gallon buckets of hardener for the, uh, all three slabs and everything. Alrighty, well, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video. We'll see y'all on the next one.
Later.